I'm doing some research on heart failure, and one thing that we have to document is something called left ventricular ejection fraction. This is the percentage of blood volume in your heart's left ventricle that's squeezed out with each beat. And in people who have heart failure, this can be reduced. You pull the number from a patient's echocardiogram report. When making the form so that my colleagues and I can put this information into our database, I was struck with a dilemma. While there was a built-in tool for a slider, this doesn't account for the situation where the ejection fraction could not be determined for whatever reason, like poor cardiac windows preventing the echocardiogram reader from accurately determining this. Thus, I came up with the solution of using a pull-down menu where could not be determined was an option. However, in designing this form, the entries had to be formatted in the form of option, number, comma, percentage. Rather than manually having to put in 101 entries to span 0 to 100% and cannot be determined as options, I created a small program in Python that used a loop to print out the lines of text that needed to be put into the data entry form software. I don't think that anything I'm doing is impressive, but it's just like a baby's first word. It's cool because it's a novel experience. I'm not even saying that this is the best solution, because it's not even the one we ended up using, but just cool to start thinking about how we can use tools to automate repetitive, annoying pattern jobs that may require code when more basic tools like Microsoft Excel's fill handle tool aren't sufficient.